What is up guys, welcome back, it's Anime Time, and today we're going to be reacting to Classroom of the Elite, episode 10. Last episode, we pretty much left off with, uh, obviously, Ryugen and his whole class leaving the island, pretty much saying that they're pretty much enjoy going to enjoy their summer, and obviously, you know, he did bring up a good point saying that there's no way they can go below zero, so maybe I'm pretty sure he has a, a strategy uh, in mind, because obviously, you know, he's there's no way he gets any points. And then obviously we do uh, have a little conflict within our groups. Obviously somebody stole some pair of underwear. Uh, we we believe it was that other girl that was from class C. Uh, but we haven't seen her. But like I feel like her job was probably just to make us fight as, as, we, as, as it happened last episode. But yeah, we're really looking forward to seeing what happens next. Let's just jump right to it. I swear that's not English. <laughs> what people commonly call fate is mostly their oh, own stupidity. I'm talking about this. Oh no, what's a ver the eliote oh. he may glitch. <laughs> Would you segregate the boys? Okay, calm down. It was an accident. I see that. That's why they probably wanted them to fight amongst each other. It was me. <laughs> now that she said that, it was me that stole it. But why are you guys gonna separate just because of that? I mean, it is kind of strange. I mean, yeah, it's weird, but like, still, like. Oh, I wonder why. I wonder why we're having trouble. Maybe because you stole something. They abandoned her. Yeah. Oh, you. Just say it straight up. I think it was you. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be like, it's you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because Sudo probably thinks it's you. Why is Sudo like a taxer? <laughs> no, I, I, I don't think he would. <laughs> Look at the Stray's face. If he says it's okay, then it's okay. No, he's probably just bluffing. I don't trust, like, Ayano uh, uh, is, like, he he plays with people. Mm. I don't trust it. Well, I trust him, but, oh, he buried them? Smart. Oh, maybe he's gonna find something? No, I think that's where the underwears were. Oh. He buried it, and now he's burning it. Smart. Oh, so she's that's why probably she's always like holding herself and stuff like that. She's sick. And that's why she's extra sweaty. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Did she get punched? You were about to punch me. Yeah, she's sick. Close to third. Damn, you were. He was able to tell that. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, because if she if if she gets sent to the ship, that's minus what points. If, what if it's poison ivy or something like that? You think? You think somebody something something poisonous? Oh. Test day six, nice. Oh my god, she's always staring. Yeah. It's it's creepy. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, you see, she's picking berries. I don't trust this one. She probably picked poisonous berries. Mm. Oh, they're catching fish. Smart. Oh, to confirm that maybe it, like to confirm the car, yeah, was the real key card. Okay, that's smart. You have it in your pocket? I thought it was going to be like more secret, like behind your ear or something. Oh, 
The color, my guy, they looked exactly the same. <laughs> I thought he teleported out of there. Why would we... I don't know why he did that. that was... I would have let that <laughs> Yeah, I would have let that slide. I mean, she didn't. She body slammed him. Yeah, you slammed him on the rocks. <laughs> so she's not going to wash it off. She's just going to walk off like that. Oh. <laughs> You're so weird for that. All right, she's back. That's a good. She's sick. All right, she's not feeling well. Her battle scars. Yeah. Why are you going so far? Yeah, she's not feeling good. Yeah. Maybe that's what she put on this side, so it can cut circulation. Oh no. Do you know? Yeah, I know what you mean. Oh, the card. Damn. <laughs> the card got stolen when she was probably in the sh in, in the shower. Oh. You had one job, and you you should have showered with it. The girl and Kushida. Oh, and Ibuki. Why Ibuki? Fire! Oh my god. Why is she running? She's supposed to be like. What is this? Who let the fire get out of hand? Oh my god. I know. That's like the first thing you should be doing. I know you did it. Oh. Oh, they have an extinguisher. No, they burned the manual. So it's like, now, now they have no guide. Yeah, so there is a traitor in our class. I mean, I guess they whoever is in it succeeded in making them fight. It's fight after fight now. You know what? We haven't seen Sakura. Where's Sakura at? Oh, he just probably feels responsible because he's like class lead. And now he sees his class like falling apart. So he probably just feels responsible that he wasn't able to keep his class together. Where is Sakura? Yeah, you guys are gonna catch a cold. It's already too late for that! <laughs> oh, more backstory on him. Oh, so maybe he was the last one. Yeah, yeah, look. So maybe he was the last one and, and he's like a prodigy, maybe. Like, yeah? But what, what, what does it mean? Like, they jailed him all <laughs> for being too smart. But what does that mean, though? Why is she running? Is she chasing her? No, she. I, I see, I know. Yeah, it was her. Show me your backpack. You have to body search her. 
Oh! What a reaction! What she say? Hey, yeah, who's here to see that I kicked you? <laughs> oh, she's good. Ow! She's sick! Stop it! Oh, she's good. Damn! Ouch! Oh my god, she's getting owned. Where's Ayanaka? He's about to come in. Saw how her face is still covered in mud. Yeah. That's cool. The tiger punched the ribs! Holy! It took one punch and she's out. Involved in what? Oh, it was a distraction. Oh my god, knocked she knocked out. her out. That was a kick to the jaw. Oh, never mind. Surprise. <laughs> I found you guys. Oh. Oh that, my um, god, who is it? We're gonna be that redhead. Hey guys, great episode. So obviously we are having a lot of issues between uh, uh pretty much a lot of issues in our class D. <laughs> obviously, you know, so there is the underwear uh, uh thief or the guy uh, the person that stole the underwear, right? So that's one problem. Another problem, Horikita Hor sick. But she doesn't want to tell the class, obviously, because if she tells the class, then, you know, she's going to probably get sent back and they're going to lose points. She's Horikita pretty much lost the card. Obviously, we know who has the card now, but she lost it. It's not in our possession no more. And then our last problem is that somebody ended up burning the manual for us. So that's a big issue. Now we have a lot more uh, problems within our class, right? The girls and the boys are not agreeing with each other and it's just causing a big mess. Uh, obviously, we see Ibuki was obviously the traitor, as we knew. We actually suspected her to be the traitor, and she was throwing hands with Hor Horikita, and it was it was pretty dope to watch. Uh, obviously, I feel like if Horikita wasn't sick, she probably would have obviously won that. Yeah. But now somebody has approached Ibuki, and obviously she's like, "Here, I got what you requested. Here you go." Obviously, we don't get to see who this person is. But obviously, it's, it's going to be something that either... It is going to be somebody that we either know or it, it probably is just Ryugen. That obviously... Because Ryugen is Class C. So it's probably just him. Or maybe somebody from Class A. But yeah, who knows. But yeah, great episode. We can't wait for more. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time.